Hello everyone, uh, this is Ratnesh Singh uh, from Keen Concept and uh, uh, I am Senior Development Engineer in TEST and in this video I will be telling you how you can uh, execute uh, your Java application main classes through Maven. So by default if you see uh, if you have any Java main class uh, which is having a main method uh, and in your application so that is not getting picked up uh, by Maven by default. So if you want to execute your uh, Java uh, main classes, uh, which is in your uh, Java application, uh, if you are preparing any uh, executable jar or var, so uh, those you can invoke uh, by using exec maven plugin. So this plugin has basically two goals. So first goal is exec goal and second goal is Java goal. So both these goals can be used for executing your Java uh, programs uh, having the main method. So, but the difference is exec goal, uh, it can execute uh, uh, the external program uh, programs also. Uh, so, for example, you have a cell script and you want to execute with uh, uh, exec maven plugin, then you will be using the exec uh, goal. Also, uh, if you have a batch file uh, with .bat extension, so th uh, that also you will uh, use the exec. Uh, exec uh, goal uh, of the exec maven plugin and uh, in case uh, you want to execute any any executable any external executable if you want to execute then also you will you can use exec goal so apart from that uh, it can be uh, used for executing java programs which are internal within your project as well as external so it can be used for all this but uh, this uh, uh, java goal uh, this is only used for executing your uh, java main classes within your maven project so Generally, we use this uh, Java goal only, uh, but if we want to execute any external uh, program also, so we go for this exec goal also. So in this video, I will tell you how you can execute uh, uh, through Java goal as well as through exec goal. Okay. So currently we are uh, on our Maven project and we have this uh, uh, main class and uh, currently in our pom.xml, we don't have any uh, plugin mentioned. So first of all, we will execute it uh, directly uh, calling the Java goal through uh, plugin from the run configuration as well as the command prompt. We, we won't mention any plugin currently uh, uh, initially in uh, our uh, pom.xml. So uh, let's just do it. Let's go to the uh, run configuration. And uh, you can go to maven build you can click on new configuration and this configuration name you can give uh, anything like my uh, main class invoke uh, then you can select the workspace of your uh, project and then uh, the goals uh, so uh, so first of all uh, for executing any uh, java class you need it to be compiled so you can mention uh, first uh, uh, phase as compile phase and then you can directly call exec plugin and then java goal uh, now uh, for the java goal uh, uh, to execute you need a uh, pass an argument also so that argument is uh, basically uh, what is your main class so exec dot main class you will mention and uh, within double quotes you can mention uh, the qualified path uh, of this class which is like uh, including the package name keen concept dot application uh, dot my application class so we are done uh, so uh, this uh, uh, this parameter we need to pass over here and 
here we have mentioned uh, compile phase and directly calling this java goal of the exec uh, uh, plugin so let's just apply it and run it so we'll see what it is uh, exactly doing So you can see it has uh, invoked this uh, EXCC plugin Java goal and it has executed our uh, application uh, uh, main class and it has printed my first application class. So uh, this is the one way uh, of executing through uh, Java goal. Okay, now for running the same Java goal through uh, command, command prompt. So what we can do, we can uh, uh, just go to the command prompt and we can uh, go to the path uh, of our uh, Maven uh, project and we can give the same command mvn compile exec plugin java goal and then we can pass the parameter dexec dot main class. In this class, we can specify our main class com dot keen concept dot application dot my application class and just click enter. So this is the way uh, through which you can execute uh, from the command prompt. So you can see it has uh, executed our uh, Java main class and the build got success. Uh, so we have seen it from the command prompt also. So now we will uh, again run this program through uh, the exec goal of exec plugin. Uh, and uh, just for that we will again go to run configuration. So in run configuration, what we'll do, we'll just uh, change this uh, goal to exec. Uh, we'll change Java goal to exec goal, and then in uh, we have to pass some parameters. So this goal will require uh, few arguments. So first argument will be like d ex exec dot executable. So which which, uh, which will be Java. Then next uh, argument is exec dot args. So it will require the class path and the main class. So class path uh, if will provide percentile class path. It will automatically take the project uh, class path, our main project class path and then we need to provide our main class com dot keen concept dot application dot my application class so these two arguments we have to provide uh, uh, with this so just uh, i'll correct this class path the spelling and okay So now we'll run, uh, run it. Uh, we'll apply it, and we'll run it again.
So now you can see it uh, is executing the EXCC goal of uh, EXCC plugin and you can see through EXCC goal also it has invoked uh, your uh, application main class. Uh, same way you can also run uh, from the command prompt. So you can go to the command prompt and you can again type the same command mvn compile exec colon exec and then you can pass all the arguments which we have passed uh, uh, in the run configuration. So just to save time I will uh, copy it from there. So first argument will be dexec executable and second argument will be dexec dot args so if you'll enter it it will execute from command prompt also so you can see it has uh, executed uh, uh, our main class uh, it is printing my first application class uh, and it has executed main class uh, through exec goal from command prompt also. So currently we have not uh, attached these goals uh, java goal or exec goal to any uh, maven default lifecycle phase and we are just directly calling these goals uh, uh, through the plugin. So if we want to attach these goals to any uh, phase of our build lifecycle, so we can mention these plugins in our uh, pom.xml and attach them to the uh, whatever phase we find it appropriate. So here uh, this is the first uh, uh, basically uh, Java goal and uh, you can see uh, uh, it can be uh, basically it uh, is uh, binded with the uh, compile phase so you can uh, bind with any phase but uh, make sure uh, it should uh, be after compile so because uh, the uh, uh, the main application class would be uh, compiled before executing it and you can see uh, uh, there is a configuration and under which uh, the main class uh, is mentioned so this is uh, uh, if uh, you want to uh, specify uh, the java goal uh, you will mention the plugin like this and also if uh, you you want to mention the exec goal uh, then in under configuration you will have to mention an executable tag where you will mention java and you have to pass uh, uh, arguments uh, uh, tag under that first argument will be like hyphen class path uh, and the second th there will be this is important this uh, tag is important so you have to pass a class path tag which will automatically uh, uh, provide all the uh, values which are in your dot class path file uh, to this class path uh, argument so uh, you have to mention this uh, uh, class path and then one argument where you will mention uh, your main class and then uh, like this you will mention so uh, we will execute both these uh, plugins in so this is my pom.xml and currently i don't have uh, exec plugin uh, in this pom.xml so what we'll do i'll just uh, uh, copy paste the uh, plugin with the java goal and uh, in our pom.xml so i'll paste it uh, under plugins So now this is here and uh, now what we will do as we have uh, uh, bind, uh, bind it uh, with the compile phase so we can execute directly the compile phase and uh, it should uh, run our java goal for exec plugin. So let it build the project. So we can go to run configuration again. and uh, uh, what we can do we can remove this uh, plugin and goal call and just mention the compile uh, phase and uh, we can remove all these arguments which we have passed earlier and then just execute the compile phase
so you can see uh, now it is executing uh, the uh, java goal of exec uh, plugin uh, and uh, in the compile phase and it has uh, invoked our main class uh, so now uh, what we'll do we'll change this uh, plugin with the exec goal and uh, we'll execute that too So this is our plugin for the EXCC goal and we'll just copy paste it over here. You can ignore this error, it will go away once you'll update your Maven project and uh, let me just clear this console and go to configuration uh, we uh, go to run configuration again and just run this So you can see the compile phase has uh, executed uh, the EXCC goal of uh, EXCC Maven plugin and the main class got executed. So with this we are done. So guys I have explained you all the possible ways through which you can use uh, EXCC Maven uh, plugin. Uh, both the goals EXCC goal as well as Java goal to invoke your uh, Java application main class. Uh, thanks for watching my video. Uh, please uh, like share and comment also please subscribe my channel if you have not subscribed yet thanks have a great day